I'm from a town where the young never shut our eyes. Pick your poison, you could ride with those other guys. Life is more than just a dream when your team's strong. We write anthems, this is more than just a theme song. Rock bees on our winter wears. Welcome to Benam, the home of the Phenoms. It's only one city that we lean on. We call that. What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network Gaming Commentary here to bring you another edition of our Minecraft playthrough. Now before we get into this, I'm going to tell you guys on some real shit. I live in New York City, in Harlem right now, no less, on Broadway, one of the busiest streets in New York City, period. It is almost 80 degrees today. It is super hot in here. I have the windows open and because I'm on one of the busiest streets in New York City, period, there's gonna be a lot of background noise, a lot of ambient noise, even though I am using my lavalier on top of everything else. So you guys are gonna to have to deal with some background noise, and I really do apologize. I did my best to try to see if I could deal with playing while it was windows closed. I can't, it's way too hot. Sorry about that. So you're going to hear some background noise. Let me see, is this lavalier good? Yeah, I think it's good. You're going to hear some background noise, so I do apologize in advance for that. But hey man, this won't stop the playthrough. Let's get into it right now. Anyway, so um, we're just going to start this back up. Now, um, when I was looking through the last video's comments, I saw some of you guys tell me that there's some sheep by the lava pit. Oh, shit, I got to cook something. Okay, let me just start cooking right now. Oh, boy. Now, remember, um, nighttime pretty much came. So now we're, we're dealing with a really nasty situation here because we pretty much have to wait through the entire night until we like basically can go and find sheep in the morning. Now, I remember you guys told me that there's a lava pit around here where the sheep are chilling at. So I'm going to actually see if I can get a good vantage point of that. Hopefully nothing crazy spawns on this damn mountaintop. But then again, I think the area is too small for anything like that to happen anyways. Some of you guys said that there were some sheep over there. I don't see any sheep myself, but I'll definitely go down there to check it out once everything's good with the food here. But then again, I don't even know if I want to risk going down there in the first place. This place is so rough. Jesus, but all right then. So um, at this point now, we're gonna wait for the stuff to finish cooking, and then um, oh shit, what's hitting me? Oh, it's the hunger. Damn it! All right, let me just take some of this now, because um, we're in a nasty spot here. Oh wow, a creeper spawned right on the. Do you guys see that? Do you guys see that? There's a creeper that spawned right there. Wow, dude. All right, let's see if we can fuck with him. Yeah. Wow. Oh, okay, I almost died there. Oh, that's my wood. Oh, that's my dirt. I need that. All right, so um, here we go. We need to, um, we're gonna have to get some wood. The only place that I can see wood is easy to get over here is um, the jungle over there. There's a lot of stuff over there, the big ass jungle. That's gonna be a little difficult to manage, but I think I can pull it off. I just don't know if I should do it right now. <laughs> oh, another creeper. Let's throw some snowballs at his ass. Yeah, you like that? You like it, don't you? Yes, creeper. Yes. Oh, he's about to get full. Ooh. Damn, these don't even do that much damage to him. He's still living. All right, then. So, um, yeah, I don't know. Should I go down there now? If I go down there now and I die, I'm going to lose everything. And not only that, but I don't have a bed, so I'm not even respawn here. There's no way I'm taking a risk like that right now. I gotta play safe, man. But speaking of which, I'm kinda, I kinda don't like the idea of this snow being here. For some reason, this really bothers me. I don't like this snow layer. Although I guess it's okay, you know, I mean, I guess it's all right, you know, it's not that big of a deal. I'll deal with it, yeah, I'll deal. I mean, it looks kinda cool anyways. But um, yeah, we still need to um, mine this place flat so we can at least see everything when it's coming at us. And we don't have any wood, so it's not even like, oh god, it finished cooking. It's really dark here now. I'm kind of disturbed. <laughs> oh god. But all right. Um, let's see. Maybe we can make some torches. 
Yeah, let's definitely make some torches, man, because I'm kind of disturbed by this. Wait, we can't make any torches. We don't have any wood. Great. We're in such a catch-22 situation right now. I am scared. <laughs> I am so scared. <laughs> oh, God. But all right. We're just going to chill for now. And um, we'll see how stuff works out as we wait this out. Hopefully no monsters spawn up here. But if they do, I got my snowballs ready to be able to take out anything that wants to come through. So, hey, I'm still good. I'm still good. I'm okay. But this is going to be a wait. And this is going to be really irritating. You know one thing that I'm really mad about with my computer, my Alienware computer? The fact that this screen is glossy. It's glossy. Why is it glossy? Dude, really? Glossy screen? Every screen should be matte at this point because where does a glossy screen help someone? It's really, really bad for the eyes. And if you're using a light like this one that I'm using, it makes the shine reflection like really difficult to see things inside of the screen of the computer. So really irritating there. Alienware, you fucked up there. Like you make some powerful laptops, but you messed up with the screens. You know, anyone can build their own desktop, no problem. But the laptops, I do like their laptops, but the screen is glossy. Why? I'm a gamer. I don't need a glossy screen. Where does a glossy screen help in the first place? Tell, let me know if you prefer glossy or matte screens, okay? But, yeah, so we're chilling here. Nothing can really happen right now because I don't want to die, so. Oh, boy. No, no, no. We can't just sit here and do nothing. We're going to at least flatten this place out. I don't want any monsters to spawn behind me, though, because the second that happens, it's a snack wrap. Ah, this is hard to look at, though, with the damn glossy screen. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to order... I saw somewhere online that they have matte covers where you can put a cover on the screen of the Alienware, and it'll make it so that it's no longer glossy and that it's straight matte, and I like the idea behind that. So, you know what? That's what I'm going to do. Oh, it's, it's coming daytime soon! Yes, we survived the night, boy! Well, not exactly yet, but you know, it's becoming daytime soon. Things are becoming good. The beautiful music of dawn arising. So you know what? I'm really feeling good behind that right now. I'm feeling really good. Even though the screen is um, really glossy and hard to look at, I can deal with it because I feel in a really, really good mood right now. So it's all good. Thank God though. We can clear this out, no problem. No monsters spawned up here. Nothing crazy happened during the night. I actually lived, got some progress done. Creative? What? Oh, wow, this is unheard of on the Etical World Network. <laughs> okay, let's be careful not to fall here. I would just make a shovel, but I don't have any wood, guys, so you know the circumstance. The reason why I keep looking at the camera is because I want to make sure the battery's not dying. But for the most part, it's good. Okay. This music is so beautiful. All right, so we're going to finish leveling this off. Once we're done here, we're going straight to that lava pit like you guys told me, and we're going to go see if there's any sheep there. All right, and I hope you guys are right, because if you're not, I'm going to kill you. Okay. Finishing this up. And we are done, for the most part. We still got some work to do up here, but eh, I'm pretty pleased with this for now. We don't really need to go that much further. I do want to level this whole thing off though. I, don't, I won't want this whole piece to be here because I could potentially see monsters like Endermen or Creepers climbing up this bitch using their artificial intelligence and actually doing some damage to me. So we're going to level that shit off too eventually. But um, for the most part, we just pretty much finished this project. In fact, let me take all this dirt down. Every single piece of dirt I want down. Or should we just go for the wood now? In fact, should we go for the wood first or the bed first? Wood or bed? Oh, let's see, let's see. Um, I think it might be smarter to go for the bed first because if any monster decides to spawn up in this bitch, it's a wrap because I'll die and then I won't have any way to get back to work. Okay, I guess I'm going for the, 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 the bed first. Okay. Oh God, I need to be really fucking careful here. Okay. Okay, we're gonna ease our way down. I don't really need to kill any more sheep because I already have a lot of pork. Okay. Let's run a little bit. We're gonna search around here. Basically, somebody also said in the comment section when I was like, oh, I need to make a pillar. They were like, dude, make a pillar. You're living on a mountain. How are you gonna get lost? And I was like, oh yeah, you're right about that. I do live on a mountain, so there's no way I can really get lost as long as I don't go too far out. Oh, and boy, oh boy, is that what I think it is? Oh, fuck yeah. I didn't even need to go to the lava pit. You're right here. Come here, baby. I'm so sorry, lamb chop. 
Oh, I'm getting in that ass. Oh, I'm so sorry, Lamb Top. Oh, I fucked Lamb Top up. But it's all good because at least I'll be able to sleep on you. <laughs> oh, that sounded like sexual. Ah, oh, man. Okay. Let's see here. What's around? I hate dealing with the forest because you have to go through all these trees and it's so complex and it's such a strain on the eyes sometimes. And plus, another thing that's making this a strain on my eyes is the fact that, um, that the screen is matte. Really annoying. But okay, um, looking around. I don't see any. Oh, there you go. Okay, cool. Lamb chop. I'm about to get me a Mareep in this bitch. Oh, yes. Come here, Mareep. Come here. I'm so sorry, Mareep. Where are you? Where are you? Where'd you go? Come here. Oh, where you going, baby? I still need you. Yes. One more piece. One more. I'm on survival mode right now. Where you at? I don't hear anymore, though. Don't tell me there was only two sheep out here. Don't make me quest all the way in the damn forest just to get another sheep. The game is really about to make me quest. What was that? What was that sound? I heard something. Oh, there's more. Let's do it. Well, there's a brown one here. You know what? The black one always dies first. Where you at? What's that sound? Sorry, brother. Sorry. I'm just really worried because I heard a crazy sounding sound earlier. Anyway, let's get the hell out of this forest because I don't want to go too deep in. I'd rather, because I can't see anything. I can't see my mountain if I go too deep in the forest. You know what we're going to do here? We're just going to go back to the outside and just farm wood from like a distance, you know? That'll be better. And we'll just take it down tree at a time, you know? One tree at a time. Because this way, when we get rid of all the wood in the middle of the tree, all the leaves will fall down and it'll make it easier to look through this forest. Okay, finally, we are out. Boom. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um, now let's get us some of this wood. And we will be on a good path. Nothing crazy happened. And we got all of our wood there. But you know what? I'm not going to mess around with this. We need to make sure that we set this bed up pronto. ASAP. Because if we don't, something crazy is going to happen. Like my crowd is just going to be like, you know what? Let's fuck him up. And then I'm going to die. And then that's going to be the end of everything. So you know what? Let's not fuck around here. I do not want to get smoked. Okay. I can't see shit. We're just going to swim to the top of this, and once we get to the top, we're going to make this bed, and everything will be okay. There will be no more problems, man. Okay, come on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Finally, we're getting established. You guys remember how many episodes it took us just to get to, like, a place that we can call home? We had so many other places, like that first mountain. You know what? Rest in peace to that place, because that was a beautiful place. I really was looking forward to that place, but... We don't have it anymore, so you know what? Rest in peace to that place. If I fell down here, what would happen? Okay, maybe I shouldn't delete like that little side ledge because that seems like to be the only thing that's like saving me if I fall. This is really dangerous. <laughs> oh shit. But okay. Um, you know what? Yeah, I'll leave the snow. I just wish it covered everything. But okay, we're going to um, now turn some of this wood into a bed. And... One, two. Mission complete. There we go. Now we're going to place it down. Let's do this. I can't put it on the... Oh. There we go. We made a bed. But I don't like it being on the edge like that. <laughs> oh, shit. Let me stop being a dangerous son of a gun. All right. We're just going to clear some room out for this thing. And um, here we go. Our bed is done. We are done, friends. Now, all we have to do is go down there and get us some more wood, and we'll be good. We're pretty much set for the next episode, man. Finally, got a bed in place so we can now respawn here, and um, things will be great. So, um, thanks once again, guys, for tuning in to this episode of the Minecraft playthrough. Hey, man, I'll talk to you guys later on. Take care of yourselves, and please have a damn good one. I hope the background noise wasn't too bad in this video.